Okay, so in this video I will show you how you can add Calibre book library as a source into the excellent app Voice Dream Reader. Voice Dream Reader is an app that uh, makes it possible to read aloud an EPUB book at the same time as you're reading it yourself if you want. You can also just listen to it if you want. As an example, we can see here when I click play in Voice Dream Reader. As you can see, it reads aloud the book at the same time as you can follow along reading it yourself. And at the bottom, you can see how much time left of the book and so on and you can choose different voices in the settings and do a lot of text formatting and everything you want actually in this app. Voice Dream Reader is an excellent app that I highly recommend. But how do you add books to it? Well, you can from here you can click on the plus button and as you can see here, you have different choices. You can scan text to add it. You can use the file browser built into your iPhone. You can use clipboard. You can use pocket to add all your articles you want to listen to. And as you can see at the bottom, I have my Calibre or Calibre book library connected to Voice Dream Reader. So if I click on more here, you can see that you can add different sources, Google Drive, Dropbox, and much, much more. And if you want to add a Calibre book library, you just click on add web content source. So let's do that. Here, you should just paste in or type your caliber content server IP address. So when you have started caliber on your computer and started the content server in caliber, then you get an IP. That IP you should type in here as a web content source and the IP should at the end have the port that you are using for your Calibre content server. And at the title here, you just do whatever title you want for this source. As you saw earlier, I have Calibre as a source title, but I can't add that again. So I just say test for this video, as you saw there. So this Calibre book library will be called test in Voice Dream Reader and just click save. Now, as you see, I have my caliber that I had before this and I have another content source that is called test. So now when we go back into Voice Dream Reader, like so, now I can just click on the plus button and choose test that we just added with the IP address from your Calibre content server. So click on test and here you can choose your Calibre book libraries. I click on test books and now here we have all the books from my content library in Calibre. So here I can just click on a book if I want to add it to Voice Dream Reader. So for example this book I can just click on download and allow. We do that again, like so, and click OK. And then go out here. And here we have uh, a faulty file first. I delete that. You saw why. But that is the one I downloaded from my content server, as you see here. And from here we can do different settings and so on. We can do adjust to system so you have a white background and so on and you can read this aloud with voice dream reader
a spark of being into the lifeless thing that lay at my feet. It was already one in the morning. The rain pattered dismally against the paint, and my candle was nearly... Works good. So that is how easy it is to add different sources to Voice Dream Reader. Just click more and then choose add web, web content source. And from here you just type in your caliber URL, URL address, your IP address to caliber content server and name it a title. Very, very easy. I already have this, so I delete my uh, test by just doing so. We can do this also if I want to delete it completely, like so. Now if I go out again, I only have the sources I had before. But to be honest with you, if you have an iPhone with Voice Dream Reader, just pay for iCloud, Apple iCloud. I have the two terabyte uh, subscription. So in if you have two terabytes, you can just go into a file browser and choose iCloud instead and have all your books in iCloud instead of Calibre if you want. Then you can get to your books everywhere you are in the world every time using mobile data and be able to get to all your books from iCloud instead and use just file browser. Very simple, a lot simpler than Calibre actually. But that's it for this video. That is how easy it is to add a different source and use Calibre book library as a source in Voice Dream Reader. Please like this video and please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Okay, bye.